hi loves welcome back to my page you guys this is an off shoulder bustier that i just finished making okay the damp part is going to be having a peplum around it that is a peplum flare around it but then i want to cut out these designs okay i use it as applique on top of this particular side okay so i'll be using it to design these places and then the the sleeve as well but now to cut this out i am going to put this aside and then this is the fabric i'm going to be using to do it the same fabric anyway and you can see i have my designs now to be able to cut out this design i've already taught you guys how to do this but here i'm going to be showing you some tricks which you are going to be using as well okay another trick which you can use so here i have a peplum stay so i'll be gumming this peplum stay into this fabric you all would agree with me that this peplum stay is kind of difficult at times to gum because the gum on it is not that much i don't know i think that is the way they designed it so now what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to cut out a little piece just to show you guys what i want to do right now so here is the one i'm going to be using so now what i want to do is to gum this into this fabric now to easily do that because i just explained to you that sometimes it's very difficult to glue to the fabric so to do that i'm going to be needing a hemming tape okay so you might know this as hemming gum but the right name is hemming tape okay so i'm going to go ahead and place this this is the wrong side of my fabric so i'm going to cut pieces of hemming tape and then put it on top so in this particular video you are going to be learning another trick you can use to cut out your designs and use it as applique okay now i'm going to cut all this hemming tape and then place it so you can see i've placed it around where i think i have the designs okay now next thing i want to do because i want to be able to style this anyhow i want so here i have my copper wire so i'm going to cut out tiny pieces of copper wire and then as well place it on here okay so i'm going to be following the designs you can see the design has something like trees around it so i'm going to be placing it around the places i think i'll be needing i'll place it just like this okay so this is not enough i'm going to cut out more So I'm going to replace in. And then once I am done placing this, I'll go ahead and put this this way and then heat up my iron. And then go ahead and glue this interface into it so you can see had it been i didn't use the hemming tape this would be very difficult you'll find this difficult to glue immediately so this is the easiest way to glue your peplum stay into your fabric okay so you can see it has been able to hold both the fabric and the copper wire that i just placed in you can see this is the copper wire so next thing i'm going to do now is to go ahead and use another fabric okay so this particular one doesn't have any design okay it doesn't have much design so i'm going to again place my hemming tape
you just place it and then bring another fabric now the wrong part should be facing the interface okay i hope you guys understand the wrong part this is the wrong part so i'm going to turn it like this I'm going to turn it like this and then iron so once i'm done ironing you will notice that i've been able to bind the two fabrics together so just make sure that you are using steam iron but if you don't have a steam iron you can always make use of dry iron but make sure that you have your water around you okay so you guys i am done you can see i've been able to bind these two together so i'm going to now cut off the excess which i'm not going to be needing so i don't think i need this part i'm going to cut this and this is what i'll be using so next thing i want to do is to bring in my zigzag scissors and then i'll trim this out okay and yeah you guys this is exactly how you can cut out your appliques okay so i'll be cutting it out so that you guys can see so now what i want to do is use my zigzag scissors then cut out So guys, you can see I am not done yet, but the applique is taking shape. This is what I'm going to do until I finish up. And once I am done, I'm going to go sew it into my dress. Now, if you can't sew it with your sewing machine, you can easily use a fabric glue to style this. So guys, I hope you have been able to learn one or two things from this particular video. Also share it so that more people can get to see and learn from this particular video. I will see you in my next one. Bye.